G'day YouTube, it's Michael here. I'm going to be reviewing games and apps on uh, essentially Apple, um, Apple and Android, but Android uh, mainly at the moment, just given the fact I've got a Samsung and it's just a bit easier and it's got a lot more uh, storage on it. Anyway, I really want to look at today this uh, Rise Up game. So as you can see here, Rise Up, if you've um, played it, it's actually pretty cool. I like the game mechanics. It's very popular. It's number two at the moment, I believe, uh, on the Play Store at least, and it's feature, definitely featured in Apple. I saw it on Apple. And if you're wondering why I'm walking around, I just feel like walking around, and hopefully the lights are alright, but really you don't have to see me. So I just want to double check something. I'll go back to um, the Play Store here. So, rise up. Number two, top arcade games. 10 million downloads, so that's pretty cool. Um, it's a good result for... Sirkan Ozil's oh Oz Yilmaz Oz Yilmaz <clears throat> cool cool name all right so rise up really cool colors I might sit down and uh, look all the it's probably got all the same sort of features as most of the big publisher games these days like Ketchup and um, Absolute and Innovation etc. And uh, one of the big ones out probably recently is um, Voodoo Games. They're yeah, huge. Anyway, uh, so you've got the standard features, no ads, of course, which is $3.19 uh, on Google Play. I'd have to double check what it is on Apple. And uh, you've got your standard, looks like the main play button here is for your unlimited game. Uh, no levels. And then you've got challenges, which is probably levels information here uh, how to play the game so it's a simple swipe you've got a barrier it looks like um, and actually if you press the X button nothing happens so is that a glitch it's a bit of a glitch there but if you press on the screen it works so I don't know why they've done that but anyway so that needs to be fixed um, you've got your leaderboard <coughs> And I have played this just very briefly um, prior to filming this, so but nothing's happened. Why is nothing happening? Now it is. Now it's not. So there's another glitch. So your leaderboard, unless it's something on my end, is not working. So please put a comment down if that's not working for you guys uh, that's a bit frustrating because that's one thing I do like to look at is where I am on the leaderboards usually uh, pretty low but actually some games I'm doing pretty well so you've got that right hand button I don't know what that does it's not doing anything and you've got your options for points here now I have played this is something I looked at last last time I'll take this away here because you've got your standard white and then you've got your next unlockable but, uh, balloons with the in-game uh, currency which looks to be points. So you select that. Now that's selected now. It says that I've completed 500 points so I should be able to select that. And nothing happens but you have to hit the home button to go back. But I've still got the white balloon. So okay here we go in the gameplay level 1. Really cool colours, so essentially, obviously, a balloon rising up. Hence the name, Rise. And you've got really cool uh, mechanics in the game. So I actually really like this. And I think it's, I believe, not such a common type of game mechanic. Because you've got a barrier pushing away other objects which are under gravity. And air drag and velocity drag. Oh. That was cool. I thought they were actually uh, part of the uh, objects, but actually that was a platform. So it looks to be that the darker coloured objects will always be platforms and the white or light coloured objects are always the um, gravity objects or enemy, enemy objects. I wonder if they're going to have spawn as well. No, oh. ah, that was terrible. <laughs> Uh, and I'd like you also to post in the comments if you've got this game what your high score is uh, as far as score on the left. Okay, yeah, you've got the the pendulum here, which is a cool 
cool thing. I, that's actually pretty cool. I like that. Again, the colors are quite modern at the moment, the way that these colors are. And I like this here. This is cool. That's a good level. Orange, white, green. As you notice, there's always a white color. Oh, what's going on here? And I want to get out of those. Obviously, ads can become quite they annoying be very dense for users that just want to get in and have a game. Now, obviously, you've got to unlock it, but you know it's got to be a really, really good game. Oh, and that's no good. They're, they're difficult. <laughs> I've got to keep the swipe low on that. What do you reckon? Yeah, so the price is, it's a lot of money. I mean, if you, it's $3.9, doesn't sound like a lot of money, but if you're buying, if you're downloading three or four apps, um, yeah, I'll, I'll rate that later, but I think there's a few glitches I'd like to discover what's going on there, unless it's something I'm doing wrong. There's a platform. Oh, stay up. That's another dense object. So all in all, I think that this could be, um, I'd have to play it a bit more, but there's already a little few things I'd like to change in the game mechanics. Um, if I was Sekhan, I think it's Sekhan, wasn't it? Oh, I'm going to get out. That's a really cool level. That's a good one. I like the fact that you can, it's got the joystick control on the barrier. So you can actually, it's quite intuitive and you can... Depending on your reflexes, <laughs> which mine don't do so good today, uh, can be advantageous to you. Oh, yeah, keep it low on this one, just so you want to avoid on this one. There. That wasn't very clever. Oh, no. That's a difficult level. I think probably you can just cruise through that without touching. That's not so dense. That looked like a cool game, that last one. I'm going to download that last one. All right, so all in all, um, let's see. I still can't unlock that thing, but it says I've completed it. So there's a, either a glitch or something I'm doing wrong. I've got 555 trophies. I've, or is that something else? I don't know. Attempt 30. So it's counting your attempts, and you've got your levels. So yeah. Good game. Actually, I'll just get out and we'll do a we'll do a level. I'd like to know what what scores people are getting because um, it's pretty tricky, and what level people are getting up to. Forty five levels. I can't. What did I get up to? I can't remember. Okay, let's get out of here and another ad, of course. June, we'll probably have a look at that one. That looked alright. Okay, challenges. What's in this? So, yeah, you have to swipe. Oh, it's telling you the recommended joystick action is swipe. Yeah, okay. So, let's try it. They're going to tell me to swipe. That's not a swipe. That's more of a push. So as the gravity increases, well not the gravity, but the velocity against these objects, oh, see that looked like a dense object, but it wasn't, it's actually quite light, but that will change, I'm sure, <laughs> as you level up, what was that, oh, I've just completed my first level, well done. you want to unlock just to get rid of these ads I think probably something that I would look at potentially if my kids liked it by the way I've got two children who I don't mind playing games on their iPad or I or this phone but 
Just remember, kids, if you're watching, a quick game is a good game. So not too much screen time. Get out there and play outside. Play with your friends and your sisters or your brothers. And I'm going to get out of this. Yeah, as I said, <clears throat> quick game's a good game. I hope you like this little review. I've found a few things that probably need changing. And um, maybe I'll comment them on the uh, App Store or the Google Play Store. I'm mainly Android at the moment, but... We do have uh, Apple devices. I'll be having a look at that. So uh, just check it out. Check out Rise. I think it's a cool game. Maybe comment if you find any more little glitches or issues or things that I was doing wrong. But look, it says I've completed that. That's frustrating. So there's a frustration you don't want from a customer point of view. Anyway, Sir Can, well done. Cool game. And uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button at the end of this video or on my uh, YouTube page. Check out my other videos and please pass these on to your friends and uh, those people that think that might get a bit of value out of it. Hoping to bring you value every time I do a review and a bit of a gameplay on these games. Thank you very much. Have an awesome day.